Peggy, I'm worried. I don't know my husband. Who does and who wants to? <laughs> Face it, Marcy, the average man-woman relationship has tops three weeks of happiness. You know, it's the happiness you feel when he, he still turns away from you to burp, rather than turning towards you and saying, pull my finger. <laughs> it's when he at least tries to hit the toilet. <laughs> and when during sex, you're not lying there thinking, what the hell is he doing? <laughs> you know, you're lucky. Your three weeks of happiness are ahead of you. Who cares who he is? Look at him. He's gorgeous. I say, saddle up, ride, and if he breaks a leg, shoot him. Now, Jeff, all kidding aside, run. <laughs> run hard, run now, run silent, run deep. <laughs> run like Mexican water through a first-time tourist, but the key word here is <laughs> run. Don't you think she's cute, Al? Run. <laughs> It's just that I, I can hardly believe I'm now Mrs. Darling? What's your last name? Darcy. <laughs> Marcy Darcy? I'm now Marcy Darcy? What have I done? Maybe I should start wearing little dresses with dots on them. <laughs> Oh, what, what's the matter, Marcy? Well, aside from the fact that I now have the name of a cartoon character, <laughs> I'm married and I don't even remember the wedding. You remember this, don't you? who haven't brushed their teeth yet. <laughs> well, cut that out, you two. We don't do that in our house. And I refuse to let strangers lay their vile customs at our doorstep. And the Yankees take the field. You, you know what I was just thinking? The hangovers do come true? <laughs> no, I, actually, I was thinking, if you want to have a wedding to remember, let's have one. Let's have the grandest wedding we can afford. Yes, let's. I have $2,000 saved. Okay, and uh, let's see, that brings us to a total of uh, 2,040. You can't book a hall. I won't hear of that. How impersonal. You'll have your wedding in God's Cathedral, our backyard. Your backyard is Buck's toilet. No, your backyard is Buck's toilet. Now, what do you say? I don't know. You think we can trust them? Of course. They look... <laughs> perfectly trustworthy to me. And besides, it's a closer trip to the honeymoon suite. Come on, let's pace it off now. $2,000 buys a lot of dreams, eh, babe? Oil you up again, ma'am? I'm sorry your husband fell into that volcano so he couldn't enjoy Hawaii. <laughs> They sure are biting, eh, Mr. Bundy? Too bad the wife did a header into that quarry. She sure would have loved your retirement property. Oh, Al. Oh, Peg. Oh. <laughs>